Hey there friends, how's it going? My name is Kevin and today we are playing The Sims Medieval again. I got the Pirates expansion pack, so we're gonna check out that a bit and continue on with the kingdom. My father will not allow me to marry, but I'm in love and wish to marry my sweetheart. May I have permission by royal decree? No. Obey old people at all times. I want my son to learn the trade that has been in our family for generation, but he wants to join the theater and travel the world. This is just like high school musical. <laughs> Get out of here. I have a kingdom to run. Be gone. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> Someone's being mugged in the throne room and I'm still just sitting here yawning. Oh, now he's mugging someone else. I seek guidance. A neighbor always leaves out food and attracts stray dogs. They're mean. They taunt our children eat her shoes. What should we do? So bribe me for a donation to the royal coffers. I'll sentence your neighbor to death. <laughs> or move your family. Here's a simple solution. Move your house where there aren't any dogs. Li They're both pretty bad, aren't they? I'm gonna go with bribe me. I can hear the music, but nothing's happening. It also looks like I photoshopped it, so Jim is talking to Jim, but it's just his face for this menu. Alright, well, I'm getting sick of having to deal with these people on the throne. I'm going to sort this issue out. Alright, that should do it. Now they gotta go through a little maze to actually get to the throne. That should, uh, stop them bothering me so much. Ah, oh, this is really gonna slow up the court system. Oh, now with he's weak, I can prove how strong I am. What? Oh, he's just leaving. Okay, he's leaving through my castle somewhere. Alright, I need to write a declaration of intent. Women of the land, I want to have a baby. Who will be the lucky woman? Oh, he's back. Yeah, he's already almost dead. Perfect. And he has no armor too. That's what I'm talking about. Easy XP. I know I had a bat just last year, but it doesn't hurt to freshen up a bit if I'm going to be putting moves on the ladies. But my guy hates being bathed. He actually does. He has a trait saying that he, he wants to be unclean. It's like, sir, you never want to bathe. Why do you have to bathe when I'm here cleaning the floor? <laughs> Choose potential suitors. Well, what the hell is going on down here? Oh my god, look at all the women that want Jim. Me, 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 me. Fight. No, that's probably not a good idea. Ask about health. Make sure she's healthy. I don't even know who I picked. Look at that madness. Well, if it isn't Grognak's wife... You you look perfect for me. Jim learned that Chelsea is in a relationship with Grognak. Stop flirting. It's not working. Come on, we've already kissed when you were a frog. Please. All right, make funny faces at her. That'll make her like you. Oh my god, he's got crazy eyes. I would love to be considered a barrier child. I only got married two days ago, but sure. Her name is Goody. I might balance the force. I might talk to her. A lot of people don't like me. <laughs> Especially this guy. An enemy. <laughs> that kid. <laughs> that I made my enemy. Oh, I think you'll like me the best. I can show you a good time. Well, it's a bit raunchy. <gasps> well, the heart wants what the heart wants, doesn't it? Look at all these people dancing. <laughs> they have got no rhythm. Ah, white people. <laughs> Who says we have no culture? Wait, 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 wait. Grognak? Grognak can be an option? Yes, please. Hey. Calm down, you. Oh, imagine the demon spawn the two of them could make. You've done well to consider me, your majesty. I have very pure blood, you know. Dear journal, I've chosen some very fine ladies as possible suitors. I've realized I barely know how to proceed. I can't just pick one. How do I figure out who's best? Yes, Lord Jim the Great, I'll get you food. I think I found uh, the perfect woman already. What values should Lord Jim the Great look for in a suitor? I prefer a strong, aggressive mate. <laughs> this will be a test of fisticuffs. What does that mean? Am I going to get them to fight each other? Brawl with each of your suitors. <laughs> oh my god, come here, princess. I'm going to beat the bejesus out of you. And I hope in a twisted way that they can hurt me badly. Jesus, what's he into? This isn't even a fight. This is an ambush. <laughs> <laughs> he just jumped on her. <laughs> she thinks Jim is being hilarious. He stinks again. So much for that bath. <laughs> Didn't last very long, did it? That was a wild ride. A hug time, good time, but I still can't believe we had to do that. <laughs> hey, the heart wants what the heart wants, am I right? I know I ambushed you in the forest last night, but now I want a proper brawl. That seemed a tad improper, though I do think I learned a thing or two from you, Lord Jim the Great. All right, now brawl Grognak. Surely I can't win this. She will stomp this entire village. But it's really Really causing a bit of congestion in here, isn't it? Ah! Rugnack thinks Jim is being funny. Oh, she won. Well, if I'm not the best fist fighter around here, I'm close. You got some moves, Lord Jim the Great, but I don't think you deserve me. Become enemies with your suitors? Why? What will that... 
<laughs> what will that accomplish? <laughs> Just repeatedly slap her. It's like bad enough I'm fighting one of them, but I'm fighting their spouse as well. I don't see his motivation here. What what will this accomplish? <laughs> declare Chelsea an enemy. All right, stop slapping her. We can declare her an enemy now. Or just, you know, keep slapping her. Declare Grognak an enemy. Okay, I can I can just straight up declare them an enemy. I don't actually need to slap them and stuff. <laughs> oh Lord, Jim the Great, we can stop this now. I see why we've been fighting and through it I've grown to care for you beyond what words can convey. What? Oh man, no wonder Jim has a cult in the future. <laughs> if you do not see now that I am the one, then you are a fool. Indeed, this has brought us closer together than I could have imagined. <laughs> oh man, how come that kid didn't like me when I declared them an enemy? Declare Monica an enemy. I, I just don't understand, this doesn't make any sense. You are like riding the waves of a stormy sea on the darkest of nights, exhilarating. This makes zero sense. I was surprised, touched, and even a hint appalled by my suitors. <laughs> Should Lord Jim the Great open up his heart or keep this a business relationship? Let's focus on the task at hand. <laughs> yes, this is all about my future child. Now to present this contract to my chosen suitor. Where's Grognak? Why is Grognak not a choice? Okay, I just can't give it to Grognak for some reason. That's disappointing. All right, I'll give it to her wife then. This third random person just had no chance, did they? Oh, I'm glad you chose me, sire. I look forward to having offspring with you. <laughs> I'll spare with Grognak. That way Grognak's strength can be passed on to the child somehow. This quest makes no sense. Name a more iconic crossover. I dare you. Ask people for deep insight. Grognak again. <laughs> I think he just doesn't know where babies come from. I think that's honestly what's happening here. I admit that I'm worried about being able to produce the desired child, or any child at all for that matter. What if the sword is not sharp? <laughs> Procure fertility wine. Yeah, he has no idea how babies are made. Absolutely none. <laughs> He's just stalling until he can try and figure this out. He's like, damn, I wish Bing existed in this day and age. Okay, now I shall head to the forest. Oh my god. Who knew it took so much effort to have a baby? Perform wild fertility ritual in forest. Oh my god. Oh, look at the size of that bottle of fertility wine. <laughs> and so the fertility ritual began. She waited there while he danced off with some birds, maybe? That's it. Jim Pickens, a Disney princess, confirmed. That was perfect. I'm feeling extra fertile. Now is the time to have a child. Just keep telling jokes until she'll marry you. That's my plan. Oh, that's not a hug. I don't know what that is. First kiss? No, we already kissed when she was a frog. I can't seem to marry her. What is going on? Can't even kill her because she's too important to this quest, apparently. Oh my god, Jim, stop dancing. You're embarrassing yourself. Like, I thought this was supposed to be a business situation. I don't want to fall in love with her. Okay, they're fighting. They are fighting a lot. Accuse of cheating. Come on, just accuse her of cheating. Even though I... I think it was the other way around. Should I be worried? Grognak seems to be practicing her fighting. I sent her to the stocks. I was getting annoyed. Marry me! Okay, I think I'm gonna have to load the game because this is not working. Oh god, I saved a while ago, so I have to brawl them all again. Okay, I have the option this time. I'll give it to the, the strange lady that I don't know, the random one. Okay, I'm up to where I was. Hopefully it'll work this time. Please don't be as annoying as the other one. But she likes my flirting instantly. We were clearly meant to be together. Wait, why are you hugging her? I will have you killed. Sent a pit, actually. Take that, Gertie. Can Nick? Wait, why are you giving out to her? That's it. Sent to stocks. Only because you're a midwife and I might need you soon. Ask for hand in marriage. Okay, it's working, finally. Yeah, never hug my wife again. Even though she wasn't my wife at the time and no one really knew because we just arranged it. Why are there hearts coming out of it? What are you guys doing down there? Anyway, I gotta get married. I've got uh, stuff to worry about. I take away life, now I must give life. Yes, the creepy guy is here. We just steal my haircut, by the way. Do I want a prince or a princess? Uh, give me a prince. I want a prince and that's fine. If that's not what I get, heads may roll. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Plan mating strategy on tactics map? What? Why does he need a feckin' map for this? It's just a map of a woman being like, Now, someone tell me what to do. <laughs> Is there anything better in this world? <laughs> I don't know. He looks pretty proud of himself. We should keep wooing until we have a child. Okay, where'd she go? She ran away pretty quick. Get back here. <laughs> She's like, ah, oh, no. Ganope! Okay, I'm just clapping and shouting at my wife to bring me food. Does she work here or am I just being a dick? Congratulations on a new baby girl. Oh, there's gonna be trouble. What would you like to name her? Mistake. <laughs> Fucking brutal. Spend time with newborn. Who's daddy's little mistake? <laughs> oh, that baby better not play with my toys. These are mine to make me feel like people are listening to me when I'm on the throne. Oh, there's the baby. He found her. 
Hey, little mistake. How are you? Why do they have a ton of makeup on that baby? Who did her eyebrows? Dear journal, although this child is not what I'd expected, it's so much more. My previous expectations are but a hazy dream now. And thus, Lord Jim the Great got his heir to the throne. Fectopia rejoiced. But much more than that, Jim learned the meaning of many virtues and was touched by the magic of having a child of one's own. All right, well, let's, let's start it anyway. Now I get to build a new building. G give me a church. That's what we need here. Oh my god, that is fabulous. Oh, I need a priest. And there we have it, Voldemort, our priest. Awesome. This is becoming an interesting kingdom. <laughs> I'll do the pirate quest next, please. Let's go visit the church real quick. I want to see what Voldemort is like in person. <laughs> Look at him go. <laughs> what is he doing? <laughs> this is perfect. Ask to join. But he's casting a spell on me to make me join? Is that what's happening here? Alright, now that I'm joining your religion, can I get a divorce, please? Princess mistake. <laughs> I'll keep her, yeah, I'll keep the mistake. <laughs> Jim paid 500 simoles to be divorced by Shepherd Voldemort. Now renounce your fate, Jim. There we go. And Voldemort thinks Jim is being awkward. <laughs> This whole thing is ridiculous. Yeah, just go for a nap. Just go for a nap in the church after telling Voldemort that his beliefs are wrong. Nice. All right, well, I guess we'll end it here for now. I hope you enjoyed. I wanted to do the bloody pirate stuff, but I just couldn't get to it. There was so much going on. And I was thinking this would be my last episode of this, but I want to do the pirate stuff. So let me know if you guys want to see it. If not, then uh, it's all good. I'm a bit conscious over doing too much sim stuff on my channel. Uh, I don't want to saturate it with any one specific thing. But let me know if you want to see more and I will uh, do an episode on the pirates. But other than that, I'm just looking at this guy like, oh my god, it's so off-putting. <laughs> but other than that, I will see you next time. So thanks very much for watching and goodbye.